Hi, it's Russell from Voice Recognition Australia here again. Dragon is capable of many, many more things than simply dictating into Word documents or Outlook. A lot of people don't realize that Dragon has these capabilities, but Dragon can automate many repetitive tasks or make really short work of complex tasks. But you've got to know how to set it up. So I'm going to show you just one thing today, which is easy to do, which will automate an email forwarding process, which is something that you might do. In my case, our, our Queensland colleague, uh, Dilip, he's the Queensland sales and training manager. I'm often forwarding him requests from doctors for quotations and information about the Dragon medical product. And I got sick of retyping them over and over. So I've automated that process using Dragon Professional Individual. And I'm going to show you that now. Switch to Microsoft Outlook. Now the command is called forward to Dilip. So I've got an email here, an inquiry about Dragon Medical. So instead of typing it or clicking and so forth, I'm just going to automate it by using this command. Forward to Dilip. So as you can see, it's it's beavering away there typing in the message. So it immediately forwarded the message. It typed in Dilip's email address. Uh, it kept the subject, it put his name in, a couple of hard returns, then put the inquiry. I could dictate a little bit more. If you need any help, please contact me, full stop. But in most cases, I don't need to do that. I simply say, send message. So that's a simple macro that saves me a heap of time. I'll show you how it's made. See if you can follow this along. If you can't contact us, we do provide remote and on-site training where we can take you through this. So instead of having to learn it yourself, we'll just show it. We can do it for you, or we can actually show you how to do it yourself, or both. So we go to our custom command here. It's called forward to Dillop. There it is. So in Outlook, it's hitting Control F, which is forwarding a message. It waits a little bit while the Outlook program generates the new window, types in Dillop's email address, presses Enter, tabs down to the body, puts his name in, a few more returns, puts in the sentences that I, that I wanted to put in about contacting the doctor and then waits for me to dictate. So it's fairly basic, but it's extremely useful. It saves me all these uh, tasks by simply saying forward to Dilip and it can save you time too. So think about the repetitive tasks that you do and create a command to do that. You might not have learned enough about it today, but we'll do some more of these videos. And as I said, you can always visit our website, uh, voicerecognition.com.au or contact us on 1300 255 900. Be great to hear from you. Thanks.